Dim tan na 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 dridani tom dridani. Clam 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 clam. Kerta 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 tom dim tan na 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 dridani tom dridani. Clam 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 clam. Kerta 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 tom dim tan na 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 dridani tom dridani. Clam 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 clam. Kerta 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 tom. Dilena is a musical form, it is a compositional form that has a strong presence in dance in Bharatanatyam. Dilena has uh, is filled with meaningless syllables, syllables drawn from the world of dance and percussion and um, the exact origin of uh, the Tilana, some hold that this probably come from the North Indian uh, form Tarana uh, and equally there are others who hold that there are uh, Mela Tur Veerabhadraya, a very, a, an eminent composer who lived before the Trinity, he is he probably pioneered this form. The, uh, there are references to uh, musical compositions without in which the, the text is mostly meaningless even in ancient texts. But uh, Tarana as the, the Tilana form is probably uh, was probably pioneered by Meratur Veerabhadraya. Um, Veerabhadraya was an eminent composer, he composed Varnams, uh, Kritis and uh, Tilana, Swarajatis. Now Melatur is actually associated, Melatur is associated with the Bhagavata Mela tradition which is uh, a, a, a tradition of dance, drama, dance theatre. Um, and uh, here you have even today we have this Narasimha Jayanti during the month of May when this uh, dance theatre is presented ritually, it is a ritualistic dance theatre and um, in the context of dance Tilana obviously is very usable in dance, um, but musical Tilanas are very different, they are more complex and uh, the Tilanas that are used in dance are more simple from the point of view of the music itself. And the Tilanas usually contain a few lines of meaningful sahitya also. 
in which it is dedicated to some deity. In this case, uh, it was Gopanandana Yashoda Kumara, obviously it is Krishna. So, every Tilana has a few meaningful lines as well, but otherwise the, it is filled with, the, it's, it's densely, uh, the text is pretty dense usually and uh, rhythmic complexities, rhythmic uh, play is possible. There are Tilanas in various, uh, with Gati Bheda in which there are different Gatis or Nadais. Utukada Venkatakavi, whom, whom we have seen before, was uh, an eminent composer of Tilana, but the Trinity did not compose any Tilana. Though Tyagaraja's disciples, Patnam Subramanya, Puchi Srinivas Ayyengar, and others, Mahavaidyanathayar, they composed Tilanas. In fact, Mahavaidyanathayar's uh, Tilana in the Simhanandana Thala is uh, is a remarkable feat. It is, uh, it is the, the Tilana, the Simhanandana Thala as you know has 128 matras and um, the Tilana itself has only two avartanas. That itself would be very long. Tilana is usually performed at the end of the concerts where uh, when the concert is winding down as it were, you perform Tilanas. You know, not always, the concert does not necessarily have to have a tilana, sometimes it does. We will listen to uh, a tilana. It is in Purna Chandrika Ragam by, and composed by Puchi Srinivasa Yengar. Tum tum tadara tadara dhani drudrudim. This is the text. The, the Sahityam is in Telugu. The text, the meaningful text is in Telugu. Nidu Mahimalanu Telisi, Charanamani, Ninnu Migala, Kori Vachiti Ganka, and so on. Da 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 da